<laughs> You're like, yeah, go for it. <laughs> the moment I hit record. <laughs> you push you push record so boringly. It's so uninteresting. Uh hey guys, welcome back to Sherlock Holmes and uh the Devil's Daughter. Sherlock Daughter. Holmes and the Sorcerer's Apprentice. Sherlock, <laughs> Sherlock Holmes and the, the Multiverse of Madness. <laughs> um, uh, Sherlock Holmes, if it was a Netflix adaptation. <laughs> Where they're all like, oh, we have to bring in the new young hip characters. Yeah, they, they bought the rights to the set. But they were like, "Oh, we gotta, we gotta like showcase like the, for, we gotta do something for the young people, you know? Because young people are into Sherlock Holmes. He's an old guy, Is that like middle blood? aged. Uh, maybe. Anyway, I mean, well, I guess in the first book, he's like in his twenties or thirties. He's he's in his prime, and at that time, would have been in his twenties, <laughs> because." Excuse me? I wonder how bad the drawing is. I really... I hope it's It's gar it's garbage. Boy. Hey, here you go. You what you drew this? a little... It's, it's a square with a triangle on top and a little window. It, what is this? It's the place where he is, Mr. Holmes. You don't know that yet. You didn't see anybody. I can't see what's inside. Well, look! <laughs> look, you stupid bastard! Is that There's it? There's so much expensive stuff in there. Really wish I could nip in and pinch some. <laughs> I am done. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? Wait, can you go through the front door? Probably not. Locked. Still locked. Bastards. Dangerous to enter. Okay. So you drew a picture? I drew a picture. It? Oh, okay. There are only two people live here. Yeah, so how is it dangerous? Well, there's only two people there. It doesn't mean there's two people that live there. The other people could be out. They could have jobs. You're already outside. No, like outside this wall. Whole thing crumbles. <laughs> Indeed. Wiggins' tale was quite unusual. What do you make of what he found, Holmes? <laughs> That's his drawing. Oh Let my god. Oh my god. Oof. Um, yes, it is. <laughs> My, that is quite impressive. I'm put this on the icebox. Very good, Wiggins. Well done, Wiggins. Remind me to <laughs> right get a replace. Right his, like, perfectly reconstructed anatomy drawings. Let me just... <laughs> like Watson, remind me, remind me to get a replacement beggar child. Get a replacement Wiggins. Uh, I'm looking uh, for a new Wiggins. Houses, oh, not Houses of Parliament. Oh, no. Okay. no. Encyclopedia, newspaper, and their research. <laughs> uh... Badges and metal. You know, as much as I, I bash arts. these games, nothing would make me happier than doing any voice in this. Any voice of any of the characters. Even if it was just some drunkard. Arms. The coat of arms of the Marsh family. Uh, nowadays, the representative of this family is Lord Edward Marsh, the well known benefactor. He uh, provides the poor people of Whitechapel with provisions, warm clothes, Etc. 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 Lord Marshall is also renowned as a uh, co-founder of the special education program, which allows poor people the opportunity of an education. Lord Marshall resides at Three Mainbury Road, London. I mean, I mean, you can tell what it is. Yes. So. 
Yeah. That much is good. Well done, Wiggins. Yeah. So this man could be Lord Marsh. Huh. A lord who hangs around in a public house. Let's pay a visit to Lord Marsh. We'll pretend that we're interested in his charitable activities. Yes, and I have just the idea. I shall dress as a woman. No, Holmes, you don't need to dress as a woman Miss all the Holmes, time. You have a visitor. She oh, looks the same. She oh, does. That won't be possible. This it's a different different voice voiceover artist though. Refuses to wait for anything. What? Father. Caitlin. Uh, <laughs> what? Caitlin's boarding school was flooded. Everyone was sent home as if it could smell any mustier. Uh, what? My word. How is it possible to have grown up so fast? You'll be staying. Wherever uh, will we put you? What? I'll give her my room, of course. What do you have to say, Caitlin? Your my daughter is not sleeping in your room. <laughs> Absolutely not. Love story between a prince and a suffragist. However, did you guess? Oh. You will tell me, won't you, father? <sighs> what the? F uh, uh. This is not something that's in the books. <sighs> You'll make Watson jealous. <laughs> All right then. Okay, I gotta look this up. <laughs> will you help me, Mrs. Hudson? Is that why this is called the Devil's Daughter? Because it's his daughter. It's his daughter. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. Dot or question mark? What the fuck? Yeah, first thing it pulls up is the... is this character from this game. All right. Oh. What, adopted daughter. Okay, Kate Holmes, um, is the. Um, Wait, Tim, are you reading a spoiler for the game? I don't think so. Are you sure? What? How could that be a spoiler for the game? Maybe, Tim, maybe that's a big <laughs> maybe aspect Maybe he's, of... he's been keeping it a secret? Yes. Tim, okay. you might have just spoiled a huge plot twist in the entire game. By reading like a dick. <laughs> well, okay, it's not my fault that's the first thing to come out. I was looking to see if there was anything in the books. Cause I was like, it's not in the books, and we played like the last game, right? Uh -huh. The one before this one? No, I don't think so. Yeah, right. didn't we play? Yeah. Am I allowed to see if we played them in chronological order? No. <laughs> <laughs> you can try. <sighs> Sherlock Holmes games. Minus spoilers. Dysentery. Watson was kind enough to give me an incredibly. Sherlock Holmes games. I'm just gonna put in Sherlock Holmes games. Oh, it's got a list. Yeah. Yeah, 2014 was the last last one we played. 2016 is this one. There's nothing in between them. Can I get in on this? I can. <laughs> Boxing practice. He looks like everyone's dad. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> when you get to hit him. There you go. <laughs> you just got knocked the fuck out. Oh, good yes. sir. You just got bludgeoned. This is really tedious. This is. Finally. You should see a doctor about that concussion. Holmes! Did you knock out another vagrant? No, not try again! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we did play these in chronological order, and no, that, like, there was nothing like that in the previous, previous game. <laughs> in fact, I don't, I don't think I've played any of these games where... Yeah, I can't think of a single one. Which is kind of a disappointment. Yeah. However, cliche. Like, I mean, true. You know, but like, at some point. There you go. Please do not do this again. <laughs> uh, so. Please, for the love of God. That was still 28 seconds, the exact same as the other one? Yeah, no. Uh, yeah. Exit. I don't need a try. Are you sure you want to exit? You did so great. 
So, um, Do where's my anything? money? I just beat your... Your champion. Your champion. This, this is just practice, so we're not, we're not taking it seriously. I take I'm it taking very it. seriously. <laughs> I take beating someone's ass very seriously. In and if there ways. are fists bare-knuckle brawling, I expect to be paid in more than blood. <laughs> it's quite a bit on the, the streets. What? Oh, the Scotland Yard. Oh! I just happened to find my way here. Can I, uh, can I go in? Knock, knock. Who is it? Sherlock Holmes. Ah, uh, no one's here. <laughs> <laughs> no, no one's here. No one's here. Scotland Yard. Hmm. I hope I won't need them. For any reason what? ever. So ever. Mm, practical motherhood and parent craft. He's, he's reading about how to be a parent. How to be a good father to your Holmes, about Caitlin. Yes? She has grown up, hasn't she? Don't you think it's time to to tell her? To tell her I what? told you, you son of a bitch! Father. No, <laughs> absolutely never. Do you hear me? Holmes, it's you like a, the, the next cutscene. The next cutscene. I will bleep it out in the edit, but the next cutscene. Seriously, it's not a spoiler. Tim. And can't happen. You're just like, oh, I'm gonna read this out loud. <laughs> it's not. Come on. <clears throat> like, okay, so. Would it be weird if the entire game actually just turns out to be like just a just a good day to you becoming a father story? It has nothing to do with crime solving and it's just like a hallmark drama. Don't get me wrong. Yes, I would laugh. <laughs> oh my god. He's also high. Red eyes uh feels unwell. Um mm -mm. Uh, gold ring, man of wealth, no shit. Uh, he is ill. He is, or he is hiding something. But his I'm large penis, or his small penis. Painkillers. Oh, Freshly shined shoes. Uh, Lord Marshal's personal assistant. Yes, his cook. Uh, interesting. Oh, he's a doctor. A uh, member of hunting club, <laughs> as well as being a doctor. Stethoscope, physician. I have everything. And validate. Character portrait complete. Now I see your legs. I hope we're not disturbing you. You are with your physician. So room full of doctors. <laughs> But no, please, I'm intrigued by your visit, Mr. Holmes. I'm glad to hear it. The last thing I'd wish is to upset the patient. Lord Marsh, can I just say that I admire all of your efforts in assisting the poor of London? Ah, uh, yes. It is a war that we must fight on our streets and now, too, from my home. You must surely have noticed those bags full of items, clothing and books for the unfortunate. That is inspiration. Do you plan on burning them? Are you moving? I don't see why not. I already have the valuable assistance of Dr. Fisher, who happens to be my personal physician. What accent? Is it a German accent? It sounds like a German accent. Me, Lord Marsh. You're looking very pale. <clears throat> Might I offer Dr. Watson's assistance? That is kind of you. But I feel confident that I can provide Lord Marsh with the care that he requires. How long have you been like this, my lord? I'm fine, Dr. Watson. Don't fuss. It's only influenza. I'll be better in a few days. I can feel it all right. In that case, why are you taking such powerful painkillers? Excuse me, what do you mean? 
Mr. Holmes is referring to the pills <coughs> on your table. They're literally <laughs> sitting there label <laughs> facing us. You idiot. That's not, he's not even the real Sherlock. He can still tell. He was wearing fake a fake beard. Well done. You are right. I do occasionally frequent a few hostelries over there, would you believe it? Oh, wait, no. Is that the same guy? I can't tell. But there, dressed as a working man, I can approach the other fellows to see if they might be interested in a special job. A special job? May I ask what you're referring to? The mutton chops to fill out his cheeks. Yeah. Very sunken. His special education program in 1889, he for the Sherlock Holmes movies and games makes it makes it seem like face, fake facial hair was common. Was it? I don't know. I mean, it wouldn't have been very difficult. It just would have been very uncomfortable. And it wouldn't have been very convincing. In order to truly see, one requires vision, yes? No. I mean, the methods that we use for, you know, uh, fake facial hair nowadays, I mean... Let's close this Part of it is using like just certain types of animal hair that you know resembles, you know, uh, human like um, you know facial hair that like um, yeah, it's, it's hair the and... connecting it to the face though. Yeah. Lord Marsh believes that he can help all these poor people. He's crazy. I'm gratified by your interest. <laughs> I'm trying to keep him home and calm. Hmm. Lord Marsh even helps hospitals. What a bastard! I mean, honestly. My. Card. No, no, just I guess I'll go around the chair. A provision dealing with the paupers of Whitechapel. Hmm. Interesting. Don't mind me. I'm just going to go Last through all your stuff. Orphans were put through medical college. Uh. Lord did they have basic education? education? No, Tim. They <coughs> were still orphans. Like whether or not they're in their twenties. <laughs> 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 Batman's an orphan. <laughs> and he will remind you of that. Every single series. All in due time, my lord. Did I get like you said like malaria? And we just some papers. Document with a seal. Golden name. ticket. I've got to go. Are you Willy Wonka? Uh, dear Lord Marsh, here is the list of uh, selected participants for the special education program in October. Uh, oh, hey, there's John Strawberry. Um, it looks to be a very promising event. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, Kelly uh, Strawberry. John Strobridge. I've seen this name before. But I... Strawbridge. Strawbridge. You can't say Strawberry. Well, no, I said Strobridge the first time, but you were the one who was like Strawberry Shortcake Bridge. Don't embarrass me, Mr. Holmes, but indeed these people have become like a family to me. That would be a fairly large family, I imagine. <laughs> yes, the, the list would be longer than any of your short stories. As for how large, well. Fisher is the one who keeps record. I'm uh, sorry, are, are we comparing dicks? <laughs> is this a dick measuring contest? Because I have written more short stories than you have uh, helped people uh, with their <laughs> educational situation. I shall take my leave then. I thank you both and I wish you all the very best, gentlemen. Likewise, Mr. Holmes. Mm. Good later, Nikola Tesla. <laughs> Enjoy pretending to be a doctor. I'm <laughs> gratified. Yes, 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 yes. I'm gratified. No, yeah, I'm not, sure. Not, not, not yet. yet. I've never seen so many provisions for the poor. And certainly not in a Lord's <laughs> <laughs> it Oh, is this food? <laughs> oh, potatoes. <laughs> oh. I hope they like them mashed. <laughs> Humanitarian aid for an orphan. Hmm. Bastard. Aid for the paupers of Lambeth Workhouse. Okay. Ooh, no. Extremely honorable to Please do not restart the game. <laughs> Bags full of food. Mm, interesting. What is what is he hiding? Is it drugs? I bet it's drugs. It's always drugs. It's shut tight. Oh, there's a back door. As mm. in it's closed. I'm saying the same thing, just different ways of saying the same thing. I'm just utilizing different verbiage. 
That's how you know I'm educated. Oh, you you go through the back door on the other side of the building. That I like the back door. That was the back door. I mean, I can go out here. If that's what you're talking about. Yes. Hmm, interesting. And this is the back door that I tried to use, and it was it was shut, locked, okay. closed. Otherwise, it's nice. You know, maybe it's openable from the outside. No. Then you would have accomplished something. No. <clears throat> All right. So, um, personally, I don't know where you're supposed to go next. <laughs> well, there's two two things that I'm thinking of. I can visit Strobridge's um, estate uh -huh. or house, or I can uh, go back to. Uh, oh. Make a deduction here. Oh, yeah, I forgot all about this. <laughs> I forgot this was a thing. <coughs> oh. What the fuck? <laughs> One participant from, from the special education program is missing. Is not connected to special education program. What? The fact that someone is missing from the education program is not connected to the education program itself. And also the fact that he... <sighs> no! I'm sorry. Are you losing brain cells when you do that? What's happening? I don't happening? know. Okay, cool. My God. That's a special... <laughs> What's happening, sorry, I'm just thinking of the wrong things. <laughs> All Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm making the wrong connections. Uh, George Hurt's uh, special job and Lord Marsh's special education program are somehow connected. Yes. Yes, they are. <laughs> Is that necessary? Does that actually go against yeah. you? I have no idea. Ah! <laughs> you do that at a time that he like goes back and you see, you see Holmes and he's just like one side of his face is all limp. And Watson's like, my God, Holmes. Sorry, I, I just, I, I think it's a stroke. I, and I'm fine. <laughs> it's not her room. It's Watson's room. Who is it now? Good for you. Way to go. London and it's around. All right. Well, what? I've accomplished nothing. <laughs> Got to go back to Whitechapel. Ooh, look at me! I'm reading a book. Ooh, makes me really fancy. I'm an educated man like Watson. <laughs> I have a doctorate like Watson. No, you Ooh. do not. No, you do not. Actually, he he officially does. <laughs> he has he has a um, I think multiple honorary doctorates, um, uh, and science degrees, like the character. Honorary. Yeah, I think there was uh, I don't remember what I think it was like um, the School of London or something like that. Um, actually, uh appointed actual degrees with Sherlock Holmes on them. Mm -hmm. So the actual character yes. has doctorates in science and Yes, but Tim, no one philosophy. can use those. Yes, I know. So they're not real. No, but they are for him. But He can use those. But that's in a future where he doesn't exist. Uh, whatever, but like the Damn. stuff that he does now has earned him those. So, but at this current a, moment, he does not have a doctor. He has he's a doctor. No, because we're viewing it from the now. Yes, but where he's living in the then, he is not living. In the then. <laughs> he's living in the then, and he does not have a doctorate. He totally has a doctorate. What do you think he gets his education? He goes to a college and doesn't take classes. <laughs> That's actually in the book. He goes to a college, just goes to the labs when everyone's gone, and then just does whatever he wants in there and doesn't take classes. I'm looking for five Dorset Street, but I'm not seeing it. Hmm. 
No, this is number five. Like, here's Dorset Street. Uh -huh. This is Dorset Street. All this is Dorset Street. <laughs> yeah. But there's no number five on the Dorset Street. There's 11, 16, 12. I'm going up in numbers. I've made... Oh, no, so there's 14. There's four. The, what? What the fuck? The fuck no. There's two. <laughs> Tim, five doesn't exist. Is it the bar? No. You sure? Is it on the bar? A place that you can't go to the other Damn, yeah. I was hoping I could sprint. Yeah. Yeah. This doesn't have a address on it. I know, but it's in the right spot to be five, right? Uh, maybe? But I'm trying to find a residence. Unless someone's living up in the loft. Ask somebody. Excuse oh, me. Oh, pray tell. Who shall I talk to? Oh, bartender. Which always, of, always talk to the bartender. Which of these drunkards? Which of these fine specimens? Fine penis specimens. That's four. And that's three. It's five, right? Yeah, it's five. So then that would mean like five would be like down there, but I can't go down there. Huh. Huh. Dorset Street loop? Dorset well, Street doesn't loop, does it? I mean, maybe. Okay, so that's where that it would have come out, yeah. right? Yep, I can see the drunk over there. So, so that, that is either five. Which I can't interact with. Or one next to this five. Can't interact with. Oh my god. Is five back here? Is this number five? No, this is, this is through 13. Or no, 12. Excuse me! What is your uh, Alice in Wonderland style numbering system like? <laughs> Please uh, explain Please to me. explain. Please. I'm a man of logic. And, and this, this makes, makes me none. sick. And I physically hurt from this. I'm trying to find five. Post on the doorstep. Yes. Um, you leave the post on your doorstep. So I know I can confirm that this is the right address. Huh. All right, I guess maybe I don't talk to that person <coughs> that, uh, you know, is connected to the case because I can't. Why would you do that? That's crazy. What a stupid fucking stupid. Uh, okay. Kid. Um, child. Excuse me. I... Vagabond. Infant. What is this? Tom, Tom, not so fast. I Shut up. To ask you if you remember your father mentioning anything about his <laughs> Do you have any news about my father? Just, just, just slow down with that. Pump the brakes, okay? <laughs> I need to ask you a question. I don't have time to tell you about your father. What's this box, Tom? Oh, yeah. That box? It, Mr. Holmes. it was ever so well hidden. I've no idea why. Well done, my boy. How did you find it and I didn't? Please enlighten me, because... I think you're lying. I think you're hiding something from me. All right, that's some sort of ramrod, cleaner rifle. Okay. A key. A key. I'll take that. Oh. Belt buckle. Oh. That's no. Military badge. Oh. And this oil can also be used on weapons. Oh. Uh, did he hire him to snipe somebody? A rifle. No. Hmm. If he had, he would have shot at me. I'm sure that he wouldn't have shown it you. I need to find this rifle. He, he would have shot at you. He would have shown it you. Yeah, yeah, no, it doesn't make any more sense. Trust me. I, I know. He would have showed it to me? Yes, but... Okay. But, but no, he didn't. <laughs> Why did it kick me out of this? Um, <coughs> After you got oh, the it, maybe last it's bit of like on the side of the box? 
or check out the bucket with thick liquid. Thick, thick wid. An oil or cloth. <laughs> oh. oh god. Oh. <laughs> he finds out he's got a rich family. <laughs> a rich wife. <laughs> or like the, the son of his 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 uh side piece. Yeah. Tom over here is the son of his side piece and he's just like, "Ugh, oh, I guess I can take care of the kid. I'll stop by periodically and make sure you're fed and got rent paid." Ooh, the best part. <clears throat> We get Toby. To go. Toby! 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 <laughs> Toby! Toby! I can't believe we're keeping him like this. That's a fucking lovely. Are you kidding me? It's the best look. It's like a it's not it's like Clouseau. Like it's more uh, like I said, it looks like um from a series of unfortunate events. Yes, it really does. <laughs> oh god. Are you still trying to Play to help chess by yourself. Come on, Toby. It's time for you to earn your keep. It's exactly Darn. the same dog and same model. Yep. Why did they change the look of everything else? Visit Lord Marsh. I'm worried about the condition <coughs> of his health. Absolutely. Oh, yes, of course. Things to do than roam the streets of London with Toby. What? Excuse me. I have better things to do. Oh, okay. Did you, uh, what? So I had to fast travel directly to that particular location. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't be smoking. It's, it's not bad for your health. You stop putting needles in your feet. Shut up, Toby. Shut up. <laughs> Do you have some of that nose candy? Oh, is this is this more of that? Jizz cloth, you have me constantly put my nose in. Please stop making me do this. I'm begging you, master. I Is love that the a shitty rag? I love the music playing. <laughs> Why don't you have to bring me all the way <laughs> upstairs? I'm a bastard house. Oh, blood out. You can't make me go downstairs. It's so uh, fucking cruel. Uh, there's too much running. <laughs> I can't be bothered. You know, I'm 90 in dog years. <laughs> You're lucky I still can smell. Why is it having you do this? <laughs> oh, really, game? Yeah, exactly. That's what I said. And then just a mailman, 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 mailman. And then I just pull him off the box. I was gonna say that a cab just hits. I found something. Oh, um, yeah, no, it's fine. Yeah, take the head off every <laughs> now and then if you do. So fucked up. It's only a garden shed. Let's go on. What? No, but, oh, well, I think the rifle's in here. You're no, not going to check? It's, it's, it's right there. Really? It's up in the loft. What do you... We're all right. You stupid blind bastard. <laughs> and you're the one wearing glasses. Ugh. Can I eat you? <laughs> His shoes smell funny. I'm gonna hump your leg. <laughs> Just stop me if you don't want it to happen. I'm gonna hump that leg. <laughs> huh? He's not stopping me. Well, looks like I'm humping that leg. <laughs> <laughs> Open it with dog power. <laughs> I am the. I have become death. <laughs> <laughs> um. Now I am become death. Dilly, dilly, dilly. Oh, hey, look. Down more stairs. This guy gets around. I'm not doing this. I am going down there. I already went down enough stairs. 
What are you going to say? Oh, it's just a cellar. You stupid dog. I bet that's what you want to say. It's the same line as the other game. Yep. It's just said with a slightly less <laughs> convincing Sherlock. Why does the character get younger with every single game? <laughs> also, why is there just... Why is there a mine? <laughs> a mine down <laughs> here. What the hell? People use this cellar for storage. <laughs> no, it's a dungeon, you <laughs> bastard! Oh, uh, they God. use it for storage. Yeah, for the for storing <laughs> storing the of damned. War. Oh, is it now? Uh, tell also me about known it. as human bones. <laughs> is anyone jerking it in here? I mean, I won't stop you. Oh. Oh, well, glad that was thorough. You can't old see. Shh. Old things. Yeah, old things that might be... Uh... London is nothing but old things. Whoa. Dude, huh. that's creepy. Tom's photograph. Let's try to get inside. Wham! <laughs> oh. Oh, this oh, again. God. Oh, Actually, what this doesn't the... look that bad. Uh Oh shit, I forgot that you gotta use Oh Did I do it? I did it. That was it. it. I, I was expecting more. Yeah. That didn't feel right. Just rubbish. <laughs> Fucking rubbish. Looks in there, sees the you know the cover of the game. Just rubbish. <laughs> Of effing forest. Of effing forest. Of effing forest. This effing I hate forest. this place. Oh, those are bullet. Uh, or that's a box for uh, bullet. Uh, for bullets. <laughs> it's a box for bullets. Are there bullets in it? No, no, no. You gotta buy the <laughs> box first, and then you put bullets in it. It's like one of those uh, wine, like uh, six pack wine <laughs> carriers. <laughs> you buy the the carrier, and then you buy the you wine. You buy the wine. You gotta buy the it. wine separately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dear George, I do understand. Or a DVD you. shelf. <laughs> I do understand you, and it's so sad. Same as you, I d can't find a job, not even the smallest thing. My children have nothing to eat. When I try to find anything, the bosses just blah, say blah, that they blah, don't poverty want in white chapel working for them. Tales Our military service means nothing. Time. Nobody cares. By Her Royal Majesty Queen Victoria. She demands that you United eat cake Kingdom and quit Great bitching. Britain in Ireland, I, Frederick Russell Burnham, Major of the <laughs> British Army, declare the country <laughs> extends its gratitude to Ge George <laughs> Hurst, an honorable soldier name. of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Ireland. For his valiant military service. Sir Frederick Russell Birmingham the third. The British Army hereby awards him the Distinguished Conduct Medal and retire him due to the injuries sustained while in duty. We shall support him in no way. Uh, ooh. Uh, oh. Three, what, three, 303? Savage Soft Point? Yeah, those are, they're basically like pistol rounds with a very long... A uh, load of black powder behind them. Well, I mean, that's basically... I mean, a uh, 5.56 is the same uh, diameter as a 9mm. Yeah. <laughs> but the, the shell casing is completely different. As in, like, the shell it's in? Because it, it, looks, it looks a little bit more like a beer bottle. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, it's a, it's a tapered... Yeah. That we found earlier. <clears throat> This is the list of selected participants for October's special education program. Uh-huh. According to this poster, John Strowbridge is missing. Yes. Let's compare them with people from Hearst documents. Okay. So... Uh... Nope. Nothing there. Thomas Kelly. This man appears in both documents. William. Yeah. William. Thatcher. Thupth. Uh, Patrick Tanner, and then we need a, no, that's it. John Strowbridge. Oh, there it is. 
All the people in Marsh's document are marked and dated in George Hurst's files. These people are all dead. Is George assassinating these guys? I think he is. News clippings on lords in the education program. Why are they here? Like I was saying, like they, they hired him to be a sniper. Uh, Lord Marsh's association with his friends, Lord Harrington and Lord Collins, in the co -found, uh, is the co-founder of the uh, Special Education Program. Uh. In assisting the poor to build better lives and, come cer and more certain futures, these three gentlemen surely help lift the level of our struggling society. Okay. Yes. Uh, this is a gunner's, uh, a gunman's bunker. Oh, there's two bolts. Uh, <sighs> boop. This case must have been full of cartridges. Uh, that's what you needed to find out. I need to find out how one uses a box full of bullets. Yeah, no shit. Sherlock. I really feel like he's dumb in this version. Is it just me? I feel like he's dumber. Uh, I mean, like, it's insane. Uh, I don't think there's actual penalties for preparations for, for getting it wrong. I just think they want you to feel like refused, there's penalties. Uh, wound. Um, oh. Oh. Uh, poppers list. Uh, uh, it's like, I will gladly sacrifice all the memories of Mycroft. <laughs> Okay. Our special job. Farewell ladder. For ladder. Ladder. Refuse missing. A farewell ladder. Uh, well, I'm gonna let you do that, and I'm gonna do the outro. Okay. Um, because I mean, I really don't think that this changes anything. <laughs> so anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Totally fine. Subscribe if you're new. Bell for notifications, and leave down in the comment section below. I'd like to see us play any other games. Uh, yeah, and then maybe. Um, you know, maybe sometime soon we'll find out whose daughter that is. You know? Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, we will find out that Gosh. at some point in time. That's a crazy mystery right that's, there. That's it's it's eating me up inside. It's really eating me up. Uh, <laughs> it's killing me. It's absolutely killing me. Um, but yeah, uh, that's gonna be it. And until next time, peace.